the Halloween update is finally here. We have a new soundtrack, as you can hear. The soundtrack is actually so cool. We have a pumpkin. Oh my god. Okay. This is a huge update. Let's just start from the beginning. Coffin boat, which is a limited item. Goblin shark. Yes, a goblin shark. A new shark cage game mode. That's really exciting. A new board builder submarine. Yes, a board builder submarine. Awesome pumpkin launcher. This is such a huge update. Oh my god, there's like a witch. There's multiple witches flying around on a broomstick. That's so cool. Skeletons everywhere and yo, the bubbles are green. The portal is now orange. Well, I mean, this lobby is so cool. I want to see it from the outside. Wow. I mean, this is beautiful. Orange trees and everything. Even the grass is orange. There is also lightning. Well, let's check out the shop. Here is a coffin bot from Sharbite One. Let's go to the feature tab and oh my god. Oh my god. That's beautiful. That's ugly in a beautiful way. That is crazy. And then the pumpkin launcher. I'm speechless. This is actually a huge update. Let's check out the submarine. So, here it is. 19,000 teeth. It's it's a decent size actually. I mean, let's buy it. There we go. Oh, this is submarine. So if you want to place stuff inside, the outer part actually becomes invisible. As you can see, this is really nice. We have three decks. Alright, let's just join a public server. Alright, let's start with the coffin boat. There we go. And I'm also going to buy the goblin shark just in case I become the shark. I mean, this thing is so cool. Here is my coffin boat from Sharbite 1. Yo, look at the rocks. This is so cool. Right, let's drive it, so... Okay, yeah, it is pretty slow, but... I mean, it handles like a champ. Wow. What is that horn? That's crazy, okay. I love this boat, so it's 725 teeth, I think, yeah. So it's pretty cheap, make sure to get it, because it's a limited item. And yeah, it's really nice. Let me actually get the pumpkin launcher. There we go. Here is the new shark cage drop boat. Alright, I'm actually really curious to see what this is. So I think this is like the raft or like the old rig, but you spawn underwater in the shark cage. Well, let's see. Um, yeah, kind of. <laughs> okay, I'm kind of confused, I'm gonna be honest with you. But here is the launcher. And yo, the fire effect are so cool. Does it like drop it manually or something who's placing all of those mines okay here is the shark so this is a launcher whoa that that that's fast it shoots really fast and i cannot use it underwater that's a shame all right so i need to get out somehow please okay well what now i'm kind of confused on how this works and i don't see the shark Yo, that thing shoots so quickly. W look at this. Oh, so it's like an actual launcher. Like the coconut launcher. Well, I mean, that's crazy. I think that the DPS is crazy, but it's gonna be really hard to hit the shark. Well, like, I mean, it doesn't really work underwater, once again. Yeah, I don't know about this gun. I mean, it looks really cool. But I still haven't hit the shark because it's underwater. Alright, another one of these. That's cool. I'm gonna choose like a better gun because I cannot test this one underwater. Um, I mean, I have to get a free cam shot of this. This is so cool. What is that? Does it like go up and down randomly? I don't really understand. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> Here's the shark. And this is gonna be pretty scary. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, this is kind of like unbalanced. I'm honestly just gonna place the mines. Alright, the shark. I'm like really bad at this. Oh, wait, wait, the shark cage is down there. Okay, well, I'm actually the shark. Oh my god. I'm about to be this beautiful, ugly, I guess you could say, goblin shark. Oh my god, that thing is crazy. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> 
I I never expected a goblin shark in this game, I'm gonna be honest. But I mean it happened, so that's cool. There's a sub, I don't think it's the new one. Yeah, it's just the military submarine. This thing is 3k. Why is this like white? Okay then. During daytime this thing looks weird, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> We almost no. Well, this is gonna be a rip, I think. I mean, the animation is so cool, though. It's like such a weird shark. I don't actually know if it's this big IRL or not, but it's actually like so funny. <laughs> I mean, the boost animation is also kind of funny, actually. <laughs> I'm gonna try to kill this destroyer, but I don't think it's happening. I think the driver is still here. Question mark? No, he's not. Okay. I'm gonna go after this boat then. Why am I so bad today? The nose of the shark is actually so long. <laughs> Let's do another shark cage drop. Why not? I also didn't mention how cool the islands look. And I mean the mountains with the lava and everything. This is really nice. This is beautiful. Okay, the shark is near. Right here actually. I don't know, kind of seems unbalanced, not gonna lie. But this is a cool concept. Oh my god, that was so scary. Oh my god. Okay, it just gave up. Alright then. I never actually tested the pumpkin launcher, so let's do it right now. Yeah, so you can like actually just escape the cage and like forget about it. Yo, that was quick. <laughs> that was so cool. I'm gonna try the coffin boat with the pumpkin launcher. Let's see what happens. I mean, this thing is so responsive. What the heck? Look at this. I think that's basically the same as Shorebite 1. I love this boat. I mean, look at this. This is so funny. <laughs> Alright, let's hunt for the shark. Yo, I didn't even see how that happened. That's funny. Yeah, so the rock texture got changed, which is really nice, actually. It's a real nice touch. Alright, the shark is somewhere here. Oh, here it is. I mean, I hit it once, it did 20. Wait, it's a Mako. Oh no. Wait, I just realized that it's a Mako. I think I'm just bad, but it's still really hard to get the shark. Ugh, ugh. Oh no, oh no. Boosted Mako. That's never a good thing. Ugh. <laughs> that was funny. And so yeah, it doesn't turn very well when going backwards. I mean, let's see its stats. So it's basically a faster hover bike. I'm actually really happy that they added this. So they basically did a poll on Discord asking if people wanted this boat to be back. And yeah, everyone wanted yes, so here it is. The Goblin Shark is so funny. Let's see its stats. So, I mean, obviously it's slower than the Mako, but... It's actually better than the Hummerhead, which makes sense. This price seems to be a bit random. So it's like a little bit slower than the Orca, but faster than the Hummerhead, so that's nice. Alright, what else did you have? Oh yeah, the Pumpkin Launcher. So, I mean, it's a launcher. Let's compare it to the Coconut Launcher, because they're basically the same concept. And so, the rate on this one is slow. On this one, it's really fast. The accuracy is horrible. And the damage is meh as well. Damage on these two seems to be the same. It's just that the rate and accuracy are different. That's cool. I wanna just like the wildfire with this weapon to see how good it really is. I don't think it's worth it, but it looks really nice. So I haven't actually shown it to you guys. So there's like this glass part with pumpkins. And then there's fire here, which is really nice. And so it's based off the rocket launcher, like the model. It looks nice. I like the color scheme. Also, the water is like a little bit grayish, I think. Maybe just me. Or it can actually be the lightning. Oh my god, I'm bad. Also, there's a sign there, so let's just go check it out. Totally a normal sign. Nothing will happen if I stand here. So it says no parking. I'm gonna park here anyways. Let's see what happens. I'm just gonna- Oh my god, did you see that? So now my boat is on fire. What? Why is that part red now? <laughs> Wait, is it gonna destroy my engine or something? Now, this is a wildfire. <laughs> this is so funny, actually. 
I really like this, so I remember these assets from the 2021 Halloween update. I feel like this will be pretty repetitive after some time, but I guess we'll see. So it's a Mako, never a good thing. Let's just place mines here. Well, I don't think we're fast enough, so... I don't know, I think this is like random, the shark cage. What the heck, what was that? It like flew and ate everyone. Oh wow, I completely forgot about the submarine. Let's just make one right now. So here is the Odyssey submarine. First off, I wanna put a paint. I think I'm gonna do Astra because I kind of like how that looks. Actually, I'm gonna do this white snow hex skin. I think it looks nice on the sub. I can always change it. And I didn't actually look how many turrets you can place on this. So let's quickly check it out. One small and one medium. All right, that's not too bad. So I'm gonna put my favorite medium turret. Like, I don't know, I guess here? I'm not sure how this works, but there we go. We can also place a small one, but I'm gonna do the double turret. We can place stuff here. Well, you already know what I'm placing here, right? Okay, that's kind of funny, actually. Okay, I wanna see the inside. So, okay, this is the driver's seat. Let me just do this. Here's the driver's seat, right? And you can just place anything you want in this green area inside of the boat. And wait, there's a ladder here. That's cool. I'm just gonna place some general stuff, so give me a second. Wait, you can actually put the toilet beam on the submarine. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, let's not forget the golden toilet. Not the RGB toilet because I hate it. I don't know, I'm just gonna place it here in the corner because why not? You gotta get a privacy, right? Oh yeah, you can do carpets here. I kind of like that, so... And I'm just gonna... What? You can just do this? Wait, you can actually place stuff in the grain? Wait, why can you place stuff here? Oh, okay, that's kind of weird, but you can see the green on the bottom of this plate, I guess. So yes, we can play stuff there. I'm gonna put this arcade machine here. And I know this is just ugly. I wanna do a live stream where I sort out all of my boat builder boats because right now they're all just messy and I don't understand which boats I have. So yeah, hopefully I can do that soon and let's just fix it. Yeah, I think that's fine. I'm also gonna put a present here. Why not? Yeah, so I think this is it for now. Here is the interior. Oh wow, this looks really nice. Let's check it out in a round. Here is the sub. I'm so excited to check this out. So this is 19,000. And oh my god. It's like... That's so sick. So I mean it's decently fast. It's basically as fast as the military submarine, I think. This is 120, the other one is 125. That's really nice, the handling is so smooth as well. Of course the same E and Q controls as always. And you can place custom turrets, this is such a cool update. Definitely the, my favorite update of this year. Oh, wait, let me actually explore it, what am I doing? So, here we have a window, this is so cool. And a lot more windows here, my monkey. And just a bunch of stuff from a kitchen. An arcade machine, a golden egg, and a bunch of fridges. And a golden toilet, which I cannot access, sadly. Well, I can. I can, actually. <laughs> Alright, so... Oh my god, what is going on? What happened to my boat? No! Why is this a thing? What happened? <laughs> what? I'm like inside the submarine now. What is going on? Well, someone killed the shark, so that's a good thing. Also, in this update, apparently they buffed the Megalodon. And so apparently it's easier to eat people now, so let's check it out. Oh wait, I completely missed this coffin boat. <laughs> it's so small. There's so many of them as well. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's actually way easier to eat people now, I think, with the Meg. So I think this shark is actually worth it now, maybe. Right, come here, ducky. Okay, this Meg is too fast for this kind of stuff. I changed its color and I think it looks better. Oh, it's kind of weird. <laughs> I do love it though. We finally have a new board builder hole. This is so cool. I 
I love this boat. But yeah, I think that's basically it and I hope I didn't miss anything, but in short, the goblin shark looks crazy and it's pretty good, but you might as well go for the macro. The pumpkin launcher needs more testing, but I'm not a big fan of launchers, so this one is a skip for me. The coffin boat, it's cheap, it's kind of slow, it doesn't work really well backwards, but it's a limited boat and it's from Sharbite 1 and I always liked this boat in the first game. I actually remember making a video when this came out in Sharbat 1. Good memories. And the submarine is cool. It's actually 6000 cheaper than the military submarine. So I guess if you want the best submarine, go for the military one. However, this one is really fun and you can place two turrets on it and also decorate the inside. Oh, also the bonus round is pretty cool, but I think it's gonna get boring quite quickly. Everything is also so yellow. But yeah, that's basically it for today. This is a very exciting update and hopefully we get Halloween assets in the future in the bot builder. Thanks for watching and I see you next time.